I'd like to talk with you when you have a moment. Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you wanted to tell me more about the loom. Ah, hello. Uh, yes, about that. Uh, Deke has had a thought. He... <laughs> Seems the room thinks you need more space for your beasts. Uh, as Deke was saying, uh, he's had a thought. Now, Deke knows how you can test the item of clothing that you enhanced in the Enchanted Loom. And uh, perhaps help an old friend in the process. What do you mean? A house elf named Tobbs works for his master, retrieving leech juice in a cave near Hogwarts. Tobbs' master doesn't let him leave the cave. And Deke knows the cave is infested with spiders. That sounds awful. It is. Deke hasn't heard from his friend for a while now. As the item you wove in the loom has an enchantment that might be useful, Deke thought you could test it whilst checking on Tobbs. I understand. Leave it to me, Deke. I'll find Tobbs for you. Oh, thank you. Please let Deke know what you learn about Deke's old friend. Revelio. ominous regarding Salazar Slytherin scriptorium, but my efforts were in vain. Meet me outside the Slytherin common room. We need to talk.
Handy resource. Revelio. Alohomora. Revelio. Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? Any whispers going about the town? You may have noticed we have a bit of a rivalry with Upper Hogsfield. Not much to it, but we're still the better of the two Hogsfields. <laughs> better than most other places, too. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Ah, yes, a wonderful choice. I hope to see you again sometime. It's like a place right out of a storybook. You are here. Good. Is this Mr. Bickle's home? I believe so. He supposedly has evidence against Harlow. We need to speak with him.
Archie have gone? <sighs> if anything happens to him... Are you all right? We're looking for Mr. Bickle. My husband... is dead! He killed him! Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mrs. Bickle. Who killed your husband? Theophilus Harlow! I'm sure of it. He's been threatening my husband for weeks and... Oh, where is my son? Where is Archie? I don't mean to be grim, but could Harlow have taken him? Archie's satchel is missing, so he may have left on his own. Hopefully he's just gone wandering, as he's prone to do. I hope he wasn't here when Harlow... When my husband... Do you know which way Archie might have gone? Um, he has a little hideout in the forest south of here. He never wanders far. But if he witnessed Harlow doing something to his father, uh, I'm afraid to leave in case he comes back home. Is there anything more you can tell me about Harlow? Uh, he's Victor Rookwood's second in command. A miserable, awful creature. Vicious and murderous. What reason would Harlow have to kill your husband? My husband had been looking into Harlow's dealings and discovered some of what he's been up to. I begged him to leave it alone, but he... He was convinced that... <laughs> we'll find your son, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. What am I going to do? <laughs> Please do not worry, Mrs. Bickle. We will bring Archie home. When I took the letter we found to Officer Singer, she told me about Mr. Bickle. He had been Rebellion. doing the same thing we are, providing Officer Singer with evidence to take down Harlow. I had hoped to speak with him about what he had found, but we were too late. What did Officer Singer say about the letter you brought her? She thanked me, but she clearly felt that it was not enough. It is a shame that hypocrites cannot speak. Your friend Highwing could provide all the evidence against Halo that we need. We will need something more. Rebellion! This must be little Archie's hideout that Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Archie? Archie Bickle? He would not have done this to his own hideout. Someone came here looking for him. Revelio may be our only hope of finding out which way he went. There! Archie's footprints! He went this way! I thought we would have found Archie by now. I suspect he'll keep running if he's being followed. If it is Harlow that's pursuing him, I only Rebellion. hope right. Men like Harlow would not think twice about killing a child. We must find Archie quickly. Wolves! Prepare for a fight. Tracy! Ah. Pass with that wolf pack. Revelio. We should look around. Archie's satchel. Why would he leave it behind? 
He was likely running from Harlem, distracted. This may be a good time for rebellion again. Archie went this way. I have a bad feeling about this. Halo must have a reason for pursuing Archie. I wonder what Archie saw. I hope he didn't see Harlow kill his father. He would never overcome it. At least not in any way I can imagine. Revelio. A fork in the road. We will need Revelio again. Multiple sets of footprints. Oh, Halo caught up to him here. This is not good. They went this way. <sighs> Rebellion. Estras. They are beautiful, are they not? You can see Thestrals too. I witnessed death when I was nine. Saw my first Thestral shortly thereafter. I found comfort in it. I still do. I think those of us who have witnessed death deserve some comfort. I'm sorry you experienced something like that at so young an age. I was with my father when he died. My mother was away and I felt quite helpless. It was a long time ago in some ways. But in other ways, it seems like it was only yesterday. Rebellion. I still see him so clearly. You must miss him. My father was a wonderful man. I... <clears throat> Let us keep moving. We must find Archie. Protego! what they deserved. Defender! Expelliarmus! Confringo! Accio! <laughs> Revelio! this tent to be so large on the inside that complicates things a little Revelio I don't think he saw it happen do you he's just a child we should release Tiger. this is the story Oh, what's the light come out of your eyes? Who's there? I got some! 
Revelio. They deserve Rebellion. It. Archie. Archie Bickle. How do you know who I am? Your mother sent us to find you. Oh, I'm so glad to see you. Not too loud, Archie. Sorry. We need to get this open. Revelio. Alohomora. Sorry, Archie. We won't let him get away with it. But first, we need to get you home to your mother. Thank you for saving me. We wouldn't have it any other way, Archie. Now, let's get you home. We know a safe way back. Oh, 
you're safe. Mother? Oh, Mother? Father's friends are in danger. I heard the people who took me talking about them. Which friends, darling? Mr. and Mrs. Rabe. Mr. Filbert. And I think they also said Otto's name. Oh, I shall speak with them. You run inside. Yes, Mother. Your husband's friends may be in danger. Just as he was. How can we help? You've done enough. My husband was a powerful wizard and couldn't defeat Harlow. The last thing we need is that monster coming after you. It may be too late for that. I'm afraid Harlow's already after us. Then you needn't anger him further. I assure you, the threat could be a lot worse. Please, please keep your distance. I'm sorry again about your husband, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. And thank you for bringing Archie home. I can never repay the two of you for your kindness. Not to worry, Mrs. Bickle. My father used to say that rain does not fall on one roof alone. We are here to help each other. I must learn more about Mr. Bickle's friends and why Harlow is after them. You'll be hearing from me as soon as I know something. Thank you for your help today. How unfortunate for you. Defender! Defender! 